<laughs> right back out. Oh, Jesus. Snaking insane winds right now. Oh god, that is deep. We're gonna do uh, head down there because Jesus Christ, these are ridiculous snow drifts. We're gonna see how we do down here. Oh Jesus! Oh my lord! <laughs> There's like an inch of a snow right here. That's like fucking inches of snow drift sitting right here. Look at this. Was that another massive snow devil? <laughs> oh my god, I captured another one. <laughs> the way it was lit up by the car. Oh my god. God. This wind literally feels like it's shaking right now. Shaking. The like, I gotta check that out, wait, after this. Oh, Lord. Thank God. It looks like it's almost as if it's picked up again. Either that or I just came out on time. Okay, I'm just going to quickly check that footage. See how that came out. Not too sure if the capture. Definitely wasn't. I mean, it definitely looked better on the... Look, reviewing the footage actually on the computer, so... And the winds kick up as soon as I start recording again. Time. Oh.
Sorry, the camera's f uh, steadiness isn't too steady. I'm cold, so I'm trying my very best to stay as steady as possible, but it's hard. And excitement, so <laughs> it's uh, not verbal excitement because that would not be coming out well. <laughs> At night, you get to actually see it a lot more than you do in the day sometimes. You actually get to see it just whiffing across instead of the brightness blinding it. But yeah, it looks like the cold, the front definitely making its way through now. So the winds are definitely back up to what they were before. So when I went in, they were actually dying out a little bit, but it doesn't seem like that lasted long. Oh shit. I swear to God, it feels like I'm in the Arctic right now. Just not as cold. A lot better looking to the oh, sh A lot better looking to the west now than the east most of the time. Blowing <laughs> snow advisory came out a little late, but I'll give them the fact that they did decide to issue one. The snowfall warning is it's kind of luck. Not really. Yeah, I'm getting five centimeters of snow drift, that's about it. Central Station here, hello.
God. Don't know if you guys have been hearing that, but jeez. I feel like blizzard like conditions with these constant like 70k or 70-80s. It's like Jesus Christ. Really hard to tell if there's snow devils or not because A, it's dark and B, the only it's really well lit down here. Because, oh, Jesus. God. These are definitely 70 carries, but I'm fairly surprised nothing's fallen in the back, but I think that's just because of the fact the snow's holding it up. The snow drifts, to be exact, to be more specific. I swear to God, these snow drifts. Oh, yeah. I wake up in the morning, I feel like we just got a bunch of fresh snow, but it's just a bunch of snow that's been blowing off of all the everything <laughs> cars roofs trees bushes everything That was something. Holy sh Holy Sheet metal or something there? That'll be interesting if it is. Oh, Lord, me. Oh. These are the kind of things that will, if constant enough, will knock out power here. God almighty. These are ridiculous he's a constant bare minimum 70 k how I know that is by the fact that when we got that cold front it looks like very everything was moving and those were 70 cares just like right now it looks like barely anything's moving but it's, the snow is really showing it Ah, these are, these are wind warning criteria winds here. But of course, Environment Canada is reluctant to issue a wind warning ever for this region. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh, good timing. <laughs> I love when it hits the pine tree. You can just hear it go. 
you to wash right against the pine tree. <laughs> That play goes crazy, we're gonna get something good. This is wind from hell. Thank you, Arctic Cool Beans. At this point, I don't even know that snow. Coming off the roof of that's just next door's fireplace. One oh, ape down there, so it's gonna go ape here. I don't know if that was sheep at all or not. No, no, whatever it was. Don't hear it. That definitely sounds like sheep metal. Oh shit. So, that old leaf though is going in circles for a bit. That was interesting. Thank God. It's like, it flips. One minute we're getting hammered, the next it's gonna be down, next it's down here. Holy shit. Uh, we next. Hey, I can actually see down the street now without any snow. Sorry, every minute I turn around, it's like some kind of like almost snow devil. <laughs> or it's at least a spin up. But then it just gets butchered by the wind change. Oh! Look at that! Getting a lot of them. Constant. Whenever there's a strong breeze, we always get a little like spin up. Conveniently, a lot of them have been happening right beside me. It's very nice. Once again, I just heard something down there. I don't know if that's in sheet metal, or if that's just someone moving things, I don't know. But it has that very certain sound of sheet metal. I hear sheet metal, those, that's really good indicator stuff is working off. Unless it's just loose. Gus, 
Oh. I saw that one. Oh, he's something there. God. Not enjoying this. <laughs> Literally, it feels like you're in the Arctic with winds like this, snow like this, drifting like this, and blowing like this. <laughs> oh, yeah, and wind chills like this. The little, little colder would seem more appropriate. Everything is warm except my toes and, and my right hand right now. Oh! Seriously, everything is cold, everything is warm, like, actually warm, except my toe, my feet, and my hands, my right hand, my left hand's actually not too bad. <sighs> I guess that's I'm holding the camera up like this for, like, fucking forever. Okay, gotta go ahead and, uh... Supper, I'm pretty sure. Oh, will be. Oh my god. But then, once I start moving, I can tell my legs are cold as well. Oh my god. What a drift. What snow drifts right now? Jesus. I did step here, right? <laughs> god. Is that just me, or is that like... Just look at that. Is that just like snow running across the... Oh my lord. Jesus Christ. God, I'm j God. I'm trying to head in. Without getting like sn... Sand blasted. Okay, let's go quick. This gets any worse. Oh my lord. Ah, kicked it. Oh my god, the fence is frozen. You can hear it. It's not even. Oh my lord. These are some snow drifts. Holy shit. These are some hefty snow drifts, god damn. Okay, I'm heading in now. I'll see you guys in a little bit. <laughs> if I could close them. Jesus. Jesus, guys. Look at this. So here's the current conditions, and I've never seen this before. <laughs> uh, drifting snow uh, occurring at the airport. Uh, currently minus 11 with a wind chill of minus 22. Visibility is down to 2 kilometers. Um, <laughs> winds are gusting back up to 60k. They were initially at 50k here, as you can see. Oh yeah, visibility got down even lower than that. Like I'm saying, this is almost blizzard-like conditions. Uh, yeah. Snide showed out since that's the first time I've ever seen drifting snow conditions at the airport before ever. It's actually quite surprising. Heading back out now. I'll see you guys in just a little bit. Oh, shit. No, Dash, get out of the snow. Dude! No, I was just gliding, Dad. Seriously. <sighs> you guys are jokes. Yeah, Don't be...
Holy shit. Oh my lord. <laughs> Winds have lightened up some. Snow piles look like snow drifts now. But for the most part, it's actually chilled out, but flakes still going crazy, crazy now. Oh shit. How's the snow? Yeah, that's oh, plenty of snow still up there. It's making sure because I'm looking at the ground and it looks like half the snow is falling on the ground instead. Whoa. Oh yeah, it hasn't lightened up. <laughs> Especially after that gust. Though it looks like most of the snow it was actually blown off the top of the roof, and now it's just on the lower part, the lowest in the roof. So now not as much is falling off. Now it's kind of just really windy. Funny thing is, because of what I'm wearing, it does not feel like it's minus 10. Jesus, you can you hear that? It's driving down here in like, like it is a blizzard, but look at the blizzard conditions are gone. I, I'll say that right now. What is that? I'm hearing sheet metal. Again, it's down here somewhere. I think someone's working down there. What is that fucking noise? There's literally sheet metal going on, flying somewhere down there. So whenever the winds get kicked, like strong down there. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. oh Jesus. There's just been so much snow blown off these roofs. 
They're even as close as much anymore to got you even blow off. I don't know what just happened there. I think a little snow devil got kicked up there. Face off the fact that no, there was not even much of a breeze to any. Just mad. It's not even the snow anymore. It's actually too bad. It's actually not too bad anymore. It's the wind. It's just relentless. Like this is some relentless snow. I mean, uh, wind. Holy sh! So the kind of winds we're getting right now, this ain't too snowy or blizzard like. The winds. Oh, yo, yo. Relentless. <laughs> I'm gonna go show myself a pathway because if I don't, I'm gonna probably have like a. We're gonna have like a. Oh, I'm not even gonna bother. Let's just go. Let's just go and see how this. Like, look. 
Our track's already gone, and I've only been out here for like five, ten minutes. Like ten minutes. Holy shit. I can't find my pocket to try to put my clothes in. Unbelievable. Let's go. Oh, Lord, the bee. I gotta grab a light, too. I had to shovel this because it was just too much of a snow drift to leave. <sighs> like we were talking like we're talking like the snow drift is as high as the snow banks right now. And that's like at least a couple inches, a few inches high. Oh no. Oh it's icy because remember everything was melting before. Grabbing the light. Just give me a minute. Alrighty. Jeez. Can you hear it? Oh shit. So what I'm talking about here is oh wow, look at these. Look at the wavy. Look at this wavy. Look it has so cool but here's a general perspective that's about as high as this that's the snow drift we're talking like these snow drifts like a foot high and look how much snow we've lost off the roof off these roofs take, give it take about half oh my lord From oh, I don't even I can't look at this. In some spot, oh yeah, here as well. This is just mad. I had to show myself out of a pathway. If not, I was gonna get nearly held in by snow drifts. I'll take underestimation for 500. Like, seriously. I was not expecting this. When we were supposed to get strong winds, I thought we weren't going to get anything higher than 60k. Because of how slow it was coming in. It very well proved me wrong. <laughs> Snow drifts are gonna be ridiculously high. I really wonder what it's gonna look like in the morning. <laughs> Though I won't be able to see how this actually looks in the morning. It's probably gonna be all shoveled, but we'll, we'll actually take a little peek around later tonight just to see. Jesus. This extra little light for the snow really. And now it's gone from like actual wet snow to what we were getting, what we were getting earlier to now very dry snow, thanks to the Arctic front, this dry front coming through. 
I think we're actually just gonna head in now because yeah, before it actually dies. This is gonna be hell, isn't it? It's not too bad actually. It's not that windy anymore. But my ass. Um, snow drifts have certainly disappeared for the most part. But now, our uh, pathway is like half of what it actually is. Uh, but yeah, snow for the most, wind for the most part is dying down. Um, yeah. It's not that windy anymore. You're fucking kidding me. Of course, uh, yeah, never mind. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go uh, show myself a pathway. <laughs> and then through that pathway there. And yeah. But yeah, it's definitely lightened up quite a bit though. But yeah, I'm going to show myself a pathway and I'll be right back with you guys. Oh shit. Yeah. So. Yeah, we're going to do it around the house for this one, believe it or not. I've never had to do it around the house for fucking snow drifts, but this time around I do. Uh. Winds are still actually pretty decent. No. Definitely a lot lighter. Uh, yeah. The snow just are uh, bloody ridiculous. I'm really interested to see how it's going to be walking to school tomorrow. Because I am editing the video tomorrow. Out of all days. This video, don't expect this video to be out anytime soon either. Don't be surprised if you see this video a week after this has already happened. Because convenience is all happening when I'm getting all my finals and sh needing to be occurring. And sh wind is lighting light up quite a bit though. Like, a lot, actually. Enough that it's actually allowed the snow just to fall nice and steadily downwards at times. Yeah, snow looks very smooth now. Thanks to the snow. Now this is where it gets... Oh, jeez, snow still. This is where it gets bonkers. It's like... Oh, I was concerned about not getting my accumulation. And I guess I don't have to worry about that anymore. Uh, yeah. So there's a little, little bit of a snow drift along my windows. Along my window there and uh, I'd say uh, a couple inches, a couple inches, maybe an inch or two of a snow drift there. Fuck! What the hell was that? Oh shit! What the hell? I think our e troughs are f I think our e troughs are getting damaged. Oh shit. I never realized that. Most of the snow is hanging right off the, our e troughs. Those are gonna break. <laughs> Those are new too. We just got. Oh my god. That's where that sound's been coming from. That's not good. Let me see if I even captured that. Not exactly the most well thought out position of the camera, but yeah, I got it. <laughs> but yeah, despite that, it just looks very smooth now. The snow, the snow is very smoothed out now. Look at this. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know what's gonna happen with this, but that's not looking good. That's like, 
I don't know what's gonna. Oh, I'm just thinking this is gonna. If that's gonna be frozen, once that starts melting, oh jeez, it's gonna hopefully a just slide right off. But it, it may give it enough time. I don't know. That's actually uh, well melt like when. When is the question? That is not good. That's a full like foot of snow almost sitting on the. Oh my god, this is not even focusing. Yeah, you know, let's go. Let's hit back around. Oh yeah, a door too. Snow's been stuck in, getting stuck in all the corners and But yeah, that's sketchy. Concerning, sketchy. Yeah, just all around pretty not the good. A pretty not the good. Yeah. Let's get out of here before something before that happens. <laughs> but yeah, that's hopefully gonna just blow off sometime tonight. But that'll be very unlikely. It looks, doesn't look good though. Still going. Oh, Jesus. She's still blowing. I don't want to stick out here. I mean, it's nothing new. The heavier, the strongest ones have passed. I'll get my position there. Whoa! Once again, it's saved. But yeah. Ridiculous snow drifts all around. It has literally molded everything into a smooth surface. This is why one of the longest lasting winds in a while. I mean, I. I mean, by strength, yes. Overall, not really. <laughs> Especially some of our... Uh oh. How's that? Oh, it's nice and shoot. That mouse trap hasn't been buried in snow. It's not, thank God. Oh. Yeah. Not been pretty. Most part though, the snow has ended. Uh, the strongest winds have ended. Kind of just gonna be. Jeez, that's low. So now it's kind of just gonna be a. Yeah, I'm listening to everything. Everything's cracking. I don't know what that sound is. If that's just weight, the weight getting put on, or if that's actually like a sound that should not be happening. Because, I mean, if you look at it, I'll show you guys that in just a, it's a quick one here. I go check that out right now. It's, let me just fix my light here to go direct. Yeah, something tells me. Let me actually fix this. Something tells me. That's the snow's weight on the east trough because all the snow that's been blowing on to it 
and getting stuck on it because obviously the wind's not strong enough to blow it off on that section. I don't know, but that seems pretty sketch. I've been hearing a lot of cracking. I'm really concerned what I'm going to wake up to in the morning. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna, I might head back out later, but it's unlikely. What? Oh my lord, what is happening over here? Did you hear that? Not the wind, but the, what is going on over here? Making sure everything's still holding. <laughs> making sure we're not losing off in gutters. Everything's cracking. I think it's just the weight of the snow right on the gutters that's causing that noise. And it's just, there's just a constant pressure on it and it's just making that noise. That doesn't sound good. All right. Oh my God, it's so hard to close and open this door. There you guys go. I will uh, see you guys sometime later. So yeah, here's the, uh, yeah. Winds are gusting back a bit up again, but yeah. Visibility is a lot better now. Uh, yeah, 45 kilometer gust still, still roughly about 50K. Wind chill is still around the minus 20s. Should, as in, as we go through the night, temperature should drop. Yeah. We're currently at minus 12 right now, and it's supposed to be minus 13 at midnight, so we're a little bit ahead of the game already. And blowing snow is expected to persist until 5 a.m., but based off the fact that, well, um, <laughs> Yeah, most of the snow's already blown off of everything. I don't really expect anything more than just continuous gusty winds with localized drifting snow. But yeah, there you guys go. I'll see you guys sometime later tonight. Welp, one alert down. Two more to go. And I probably expect this blowing snow advisory to expire or end sometime tomorrow morning. Early tomorrow morning, like around like when I'm in, ready to sleep. And that special weather statement, it might continue into the daytime. It might continue all the way until Tuesday night, but we'll see. It's all going to depend on the wind chill, and the wind chill right now is looking pretty, yeah. So I think this, I think the blowing snow advisory will expire probably around, yeah, I'm going to guess between 3 and 7 a.m. Between 3 and 7 a.m. Watch, well, no, I said I was going to be in bed, so I come between 3 and 6 a.m. here. I think that's when it's going to expire, possibly. Actually, 4 to 6, yeah, so I'm going to keep revising it, but 4 to 6 a.m. seems more appropriate. And I think the special weather statement may continue all the way into Tuesday night, but we'll see how the wind chills go and all that. But yeah, one to look down. One more to, two more to go. And the radar right now is just looking like light snow just sticking around. There you guys go again. I'll see you guys sometime later tonight, once again. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. And don't forget, I'm checking the door as well. <laughs> I really wonder how long that's just. It's gonna be quick though.
something really cool, that's all. Okay, I'll see you guys with the current conditions. So I don't know if I can this happen just a little bit to uh, end the night off, I guess. Uh, it's currently minus 15 at the airport, uh, wind chill minus 23. Uh, the wind chill has gone down to minus 25 uh, a little earlier tonight, but uh, quickly obviously changed. But yep, it's already minus 15 ouch, when it's supposed to be uh, minus 13 right now. Well, minus 12 actually. Minus 15 is actually expected at 5 a.m. tomorrow. So, and it's. Wait. What? I just realized. Wait. Minus 15 from. 8 a.m. straight until 5 p.m. 12 hours straight minus 15. Mm, nah, <laughs> I, yeah, that's not that's not believable. There, there's no way in hell. Unless it's cloudy, no way in hell. But yeah, there you guys go. I will see you guys in the morning. Now, unless the temperatures are dropped down to minus 17 or colder. Or the wind chill gets down to minus 26 or colder. And once that happens, I'll see you guys in the morning. Look the forecast. Oh. All the elites got dropped last night. Uh, yeah, wind chill still expected to be near minus 30 tonight. Uh, still no snow in the forecast, but plenty of flurries, but warm up is expected. Minus 30, yeah, constant. Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. Wind chill minus 24 this morning, not 29 this afternoon is interesting. What's the difference? Oh, it's supposed to cool down. It's supposed to cool down through the day, what? Okay then. So, interesting. And here's the last 24 hours. This is not it. This is it. So. Yeah. Wind chill got down to as low as minus 28 at 2 a.m. Uh, the temperatures got down to as low as minus 22 at 6. Oh, ridiculous. <laughs> There you guys go. I will see you guys outside in just a little bit. Mm. Well, it's the brisk morning after the windstorm. And, well, holy shit, it's cold. Oh, God. The one thing my body hates most is cold, dry air. That's where all this air is right now. <laughs> uh, I got shoveled so it's no drift so it has no smoke. I'm still going to try and get a few photos anyways. But yeah. It's not really much yeah, too short really but Make the most of it anyway. So it just seems like that. <laughs> it's very light goes on. That's right. It's your eyes.
here, just lights down here, the long ridge is here, so. Oh my god. That the weight on this on these gutters gotta be ridiculous right now. There's how there used to be footprints. Right there, very visible. Now they're gone. I am the speech was I've had on. Just this could just speech was wind could do that. Oh my god. My hand is Okay. Holding this with one hand. One hand in my pocket. One with the gloves on. I just realized something like that. Oh. I'll be getting more photos later today, but not any more footage. Just say. Well, I mean, if it gets. Well, we'll see. But right now it's looking pretty gloom. If you get any sunshine today. I mean, that's kind of what's the forecast been. It's at least partly cloudy skies all day, which is going to be the main persecutor of constantly. Constantly having temperatures below minus 15. I can tell you by the time I get out of school, temperatures won't be any higher than minus 15. Unless it's like dead sunny, dead sunny with some cloud cover. So, in other words, it's kind of like this, but with like sun able to streak across the sky without any worry of any actual cloud cover there. But, yeah. Hey, but look over this. Yeah. Oh my god, the wind against my face is so bad. I can feel a light breeze right against my face. I know it. Oh my god. This guy carters. It's gonna be interesting walking to school, see how everything held up. How the drifts look. See if there's any like maybe like two feet drifts, I don't know. <laughs> I mean that's possible. Oh yeah, yeah. I was talking about last night. Oh, look how high that snow drift is. <laughs> Mind you, that's just because of the snow sliding off the roof and then just hanging out down there and building slowly. But yeah, it's also very, very, very light oh, snow. Hey, I can see the flakes. So it's also that. There you guys go. And now we get the bitter ending to this snow event of a, the, this winter event. I'll see you guys back out here in a little bit later today when I head to school.
hearing something weird in the trees right now. As if it's... that damage I see in front of me. There'll be a couple of them. Well, that's what it's coming from. So it's... No, but... Oh, yep, it is. A little bit of... Pine. Strewn. I think two major things. See you guys in a little bit. Oh my god, my hands are gone. My hand is gone. Oh. I'm not going to show you guys the 11 o'clock update because I'm hoping it gets a little bit better with the 4 o'clock one. So, yeah. I'm basically just going to hold off until the 4 o'clock update comes out. Let's just see the 11 o'clock one. Temperatures aren't supposed to get as cold. It's just overall. Yeah, it's not supposed to be anywhere near as winter, as arctic-like as it was initially expected. Let's just say that. But, breeze has been quite persistent out in the north. Very light, but noticeable. But yeah, I'm not showing you guys the 11 o'clock update. The 4 o'clock update should be out in about a few, in a few minutes, if not, if it hasn't been issued already. But yeah. Once that update comes down, I'll show you guys that. That should be the end of the video. The probably three to even four part series, depending on... Depending on how I feel. And how long everything is. But yeah. I am going to head in now. I will see you guys with the four o'clock update to end the video off in just a little bit. So, I guess I should have shown you guys the 11 o'clock one. Oh, it's actually gotten worse. No longer are the temperatures supposed to get down to minus 20 anymore. Um, and now it's just supposed to be flurries, and, yeah. Overall, just cold and possibly a little snowy. Uh, maybe it localized two centimeters tonight, so I don't even know. Nothing's on the radar, I just want to just show you guys here, there's nothing on the radar, and there hasn't been anything for the past couple of hours, three hours. It's like, uh, uh, 30% chance of flurries throughout tomorrow. 70% on Wednesday. Wind chills aren't supposed to be as cold anymore either, but tonight maybe down to minus 27. But yeah, we'll see. We'll see how things go. And the past, this is how it's been looking as well. Uh, let's see if the 4 o'clock, if there's a 4 o'clock one. Nope. Okay. Uh, yeah. So this is how it's been as well. So it's actually, we actually got a minus 28 wind chill at uh, 10 o'clock. Winds were pretty, pretty solid out in the north, northwest. Brought a uh, wind chill to minus 28. It's about as cold as I think we're gonna get, but you never know. I never even bothered to realize, but oh no, never mind. I just realized. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Pretty cold all around though. Yeah. There you guys go, though. Um, there. Uh, uh, there you guys go. I will see you guys 
in the next video. Peace.